In order to impress his visitor, Boss shut the boar's nest down, dressed Daisy up, and went whole hog. Sir, I certainly hope that you're enjoying this little touch of our Hazard County hospitality. Mighty impressed, yes, sir. Chillings and champagne. Yeah, I'll drink to that. Jams for Mr. Uh, Mr. Uh, my soon to be business associate. Coming right up. Here you are, sir. No, thank you, little darling. I've had quite enough. Food, that is. Careful, Daisy, honey. The eyes of Texas are upon you. <laughs> Probably just those big old rats in the kitchen again, boss. Excuse me, gentlemen. What are you fellas doing? Roscoe and Enos are tearing up the countryside looking for you. Uh, we're trying to figure out why. Now, we've been talking with Cooter, and it looks like it's got something to do with boss and them Texans. Yeah, and whatever they got hidden in the trunk of that limousine. Uh, this is Roscoe B. Coltrane calling J.D. Hogg. You got your little fat ears on? That's my sheriff. Good man. Probably calling in to let me know everything's going along just fine. J.D. Hogg here, Roscoe. Go ahead. What's the good word? Oh, I just thought you'd like to know, boss, that I single-handed drove off the Duke gang all by myself as they attacked the bank. Come on. Attack the bank? I knew it. My gold. Hogg, remember, you are responsible. What about the gold, Roscoe? The gold. Oh. You don't have to worry about that, boss. They didn't even get near it. Good. And when you captured them Duke boys, did you throw them in the slam up? Uh, well, that's a negatory, uh, little buddy. Uh, uh, in fact, uh, they did escape. But but we're after them, and we're gonna get them. <laughs> All right, forget them. Let them go. Just get yourself back to the bank, Bonehead, and don't you move an inch. I'm on my way. You just remember, Hog, if anything happens to my gold, you owe me three million dollars. I remember. So that's what boss is up to. That gold in that trunk. And boss is all bent out of shape because he's responsible for it. We better get going, Bo. Where to? The bank. If something happens to that gold, it could mean up to 20 years for somebody. Let's make sure it ain't us. For once. <laughs> right, you take care, fellas. Can we always?